Jerusalem's long, rich, and often controversial history has left behind a wealth of archaeological remains, each level piled upon the previous one. The exposure and study of these remains continue to throw new light on information obtained from written sources, as well as acquaint us with Jerusalem's unparalleled story throughout the ages. The Jerusalem Archaeological Park is Israel's most important antiquity site. This extensive area, which extends west, south, and east of Jerusalem's old city walls, is of particular importance to Christianity, Islam, and Judaism. It bears silent testimony to historical events and to an ongoing cycle of construction and destruction. The religious significance and central role of Jerusalem in Christianity and Islam are clearly visible throughout the park. Churches cling to the slopes of the Mount of Olives along the paths walked by Jesus during his last days in Jerusalem. Also visible are the remains of the Umayyad palaces built by the Muslim rulers during the 7th century CE. The Jerusalem Archaeological Park extends over one of the few areas of ancient Jerusalem that has not been built up in the past few centuries. For this reason, it has attracted archaeological excavations and research during the past 130 years. A key moment in the history of Jerusalem was its conquest by King David. Around 1000 BCE, David left Hebron, where he had reigned for seven years. He set out to conquer a city on the boundary between the territories of two of the tribes of Israel, Judah and Benjamin. Although of average size and minor importance, King David made this city his royal capital. Due to its location and the fact that it was not connected with any one of the tribes of Israel, the entire nation came to recognize Jerusalem as its capital city. Jerusalem became identified exclusively with the king and the new dynasty he founded, the House of David. David's policy influenced the nature and development of the city from that time forward. Jerusalem became a center of power with influence over the entire country. There are few other decisions in antiquity whose effects still resonate so strongly in our own times. <laughs>